it's mid-February and it's 54 degrees Fahrenheit. underrated like workout is just going and like shooting hoops and chasing after all of your misses you saw the only makes <laughs> I hadn't had Thai food until I was like 20 years old. When I went to school in East Lansing, uh, my now, one of my best friends in the world, he's gonna be a groomsman at my wedding, he was a much more diverse eater like growing up. And we would go shoot hoops and like play pickup games for like hours uh, in between classes. And then he was like, I remember the very first time he was like, hey, do you, uh, do you like Thai food? And I was like, I'm scared to answer that I don't even know what it is. And a huge reason I love doing this channel and this vlog, I love making videos, but I love trying things that I otherwise wouldn't try because with my own money and my own dollars, I'm probably gonna stick to a lot of the stuff I, I know. I don't, I'm, not, I'm not financially secure enough yet where I can just start being diverse and if I don't like it, okay, oops. <laughs> Please, sir, I want some. So I thought starting this video out with kind of how it all started for me of like playing basketball and then me and my buddy Eddie would go and get Thai food and like there was this place in East Lansing called Taste of Thai and I would always just get Pad Thai and I would get it like four out of seven spicy. And today I'm going to try a dish at a Thai restaurant that I've never been to in Chicago thanks to Mr. Kevin Patel. <laughs> Hey Sean, I recommend you go to a part Thai and get the Gang Masaman. Spice level, four out of seven, and some crab rangoons. P.S. I know you like to eat it in the car, so I recommend you bring a nice big bowl with you. <laughs> Kevin, I'm actually gonna take it home because I know this is a curry dish, and curry, it's amazing, but that odor just sticks inside of stuff, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and have it in the apartment. <laughs> I wore that in the car! The beast! <laughs> Wicked fun. So I had to look this up. Masaman curry, which I'm sure I'm butchering the name, is a rich, flavorful, and mildly spicy Thai curry. It's a fusion dish combining ingredients from Persia, the Indian subcontinent, and the Malay archipelago with ingredients more commonly used in native Thai cuisine to make masaman curry paste. What does all that mean? That means this is out of my comfort zone. I would never order this because I would just, I don't know. I don't, I don't think I would. Today, we eat it. This is another one of those places I've almost come a hundred times. So they told me that life is simple, been real since Papa Pimple. I saw that out in the rental, so not at the presidential. Speak once and listen twice. They told me that less is simple. I'm observing in the room. I'll be flying all on the wall. Awesome. Open Thank mouth you. conversations. I'll leave you all in some all. Cutting through the noise, I'm hoping I leave a scar. If you don't know where you've been, how you know where you are? Let's cruise in the night, I'm grooving. Thought you said you was my type, I'm moving too slow. Thanks, man. Kevin, this worked out very well, by the way, because I live like six minutes away from that spot. So we're almost home. It's going to be piping hot. Let's go. I said it once, I'll say it again. You cannot have a bad day if you have a have a nice day bag. Ooh, broth. Got the Batman gold silverware. I'm so hungry. I'm gonna have a Rangoon right away. Bubbly, fried, look a little cracky. Cracky's a good thing. Oh yeah. Nice amount of filling. Mm. 
Kevin, those hit. Okay. Fun thing here is, I don't really know what to expect, so. All right, so this is white rice. So I'd imagine this just goes in here. And then this kind of curry soup paste smash this down a little bit. Damn. <laughs> and here we go. I'm just gonna pour. Oh wow, there's like, oh and there's a, you can pick what protein you wanted. I got chicken. There was no extra upcharge. Shrimp was an upcharge. Wow. Just gonna stand there and watch me burn. It looks really good. Okay, for Sean's First time eating, thanks to Kevin Patel, Gaing Masaman, a chicken curry. I'm gonna just do a bunch of the broth, which will really get a sense of the heat. This looks damn good. Here we go, Kevin, thank you for the donation. If anybody wants me to eat their, their meal, donate. Oh baby. Damn, I mean, Asian food broth in general is always so much better than whatever the hell America's doing. Wow, this is one of those my heart has a winter coat on. And that is a huge thank you to Kevin. This is why I love this. I would never have ordered this. And it's so good. Stepping outside your comfort zone, I need to make like a channel trailer all about how I was the pickiest eater in the world. And it's absolutely insane that I'm eating this right now. Mm. Those potatoes. Get the hell out of here! Oh, that's a lot of potatoes. Kevin, I could kiss you and start crying. This is so good. Four out of seven. I'd say for Thai food, that's a pretty good, that's a good four out of seven. Like, I think they nailed that. Yellow curry, potatoes, sauteed in coconut milk with peanuts and chicken. I wonder what their seven out of seven's like. This is so nice. Mm, this is a winter meal. If your Rangoons aren't making that noise, the restaurant's doing it wrong. I love this order in this video because it's exactly like what Kevin loves and he gets. So having someone else try like your your baby and reacting to it is very like honest. Cause like, what if I was like, dude, not my thing, which is totally fine. But this is so my thing. These big, huge bites of chicken. It's not like little tiny pieces. That's like shredded off into chicken breast. Rice is sticky, spice is deep. You get that like coconut curry kind of consistency. The potatoes are tender. What a solid winter day. It says there's like peanuts in it. It almost, I thought they were like chickpeas. 14 bucks for this. Worth it. How many of you guys are gonna go get curry food tonight? I remember eating at Taste of Thai in East Lansing with Eddie. And it was the first time, other than going to like Buffalo Wild Wings, where I remember having like a controlled, kind of like hot throat and like kind of gentle nose run, but like in an enjoyable way, which I know is ridiculous. If you're not a spice person, you're like, why would you want that? There's something about like, I don't know, there's more of your senses that are firing. And Thai food has such a unique spice. It's not just like blast you, smoke you out. It can, but most of the time, if you find your like, your sweet spot, like a four out of seven, you can just kind of coast being a little, a little spiced the whole meal. I really love that. When I want that like winter soup feeling, I always think of like ramen, I think of like egg drop soup from a Chinese restaurant. I need to start thinking more in this vein. Like on a Sunday night, on a really cold Sunday, like in later February, like this would be perfect for that. This to me is not really like a Friday night meal. <laughs> It'd be a good midweek meal. Like I could break up these potatoes, but I kind of like eating them whole. While we're showing thanks to Kevin, let's also show thanks to Nancy Remling, Aaron Bowman, Tyler Russell, the Indie JT, David Demanchik, and my homie Megan Jeffries for all the donations, the super thanks, the PayPal, the Venmos. Thank you guys for donating to see the food vlogs continue. Oh, we got a nose run going. These are some of the best Rangoons I've had in Chicago. I've lived in so many different places and I've like find, found my Chinese food spots and there's so many places that do it and there's like no filling where they're not crispy at all. These are, I like that they're not that like starfish shape. Like those are kind of are weird to me. Like it's cute looking, but if you guys have other Thai food that I need to try, you can donate, but also just give me recommendations. Like what else should I try? You guys kind of know my palates at this point watching so many of these videos. This coconut curry bangs. I'm gonna go chill out, finish the rest of this. Just be so happy. 
Kevin, you're a G. I appreciate it, my dude. Guyang Masaman Curry up. Guyang Masaman Curry down. Oh, part tie. What a day. Uno, two, three, four, two, two, two.